The Ukrainian army continues to fight against Russian troops on all fronts. Russian troops, unable to overcome Ukraine's strong defense, are retreating on some fronts. Finally, Lt. Gen. Alexander Sirsky, commander of the Ukrainian Land Forces, reported new developments in the Kupyansk and Liman regions. The enemy, after suffering losses for two months, has resumed and launched active offensive actions in the area of Makivka and subsequently in the Kupyansk direction. Heavy fighting continues. The enemy's main goal is to destroy the group of our troops, surround Kupyansk and reach the Oskol River line, he noted. Sirsky added that the Russians are carrying out dozens of attacks with assault groups supported by armored vehicles and are conducting intense mortar and artillery fire on Ukrainian positions. The Ukrainian military believed that the Russians might attack the Serbia and were prepared for it. For this reason, the Russian attacks have not had a devastating effect and the Ukrainian defenses are resisting them. The commander visited the military units responsible for defense in the operational tactical group of troops near Liman. He met with commanders of units and subunits, listened to a report on the current situation. Decisions were made on further actions and a number of problematic issues were resolved. Sirsky also presented awards, valuable gifts and cash bonuses to servicemen directly involved in carrying out combat missions. Russian forces continue to reinforce their troops on the Liman and Kupyansk front. The Russians are increasing the intensity in this region, but Ukraine is also prepared for other attacks in this region. What do you think will happen on the Liman and Kupyansk front? Will Ukraine be able to defend this region?